welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a fall clean out, my annual fall clean out. And this is going to be the biggest I've ever done yet because I truly just want to downsize. I feel like I use like 5% of the stuff in my closet. And with the job that I have, which I feel so blessed to have, I get clothes every so often, as you guys know. So it's time that I actually do an intensive fall clean out. With that being said, I haven't cleaned my closet since the last video, which I think it's been two months. Um, I do pick up here and there, but it's gotten pretty bad. So fair warning to those that judge me, it's going to be a hot one. I just don't find space for anything anymore. So I just stopped organizing, to be honest. I'm also going to be selling some things on Poshmark. So make sure to check it out. I'm going to link it down below. Hopefully I have things listed before this video goes live. But if not, follow me on Instagram because I'll update you there. But let's show you the hot mess. All right, so this is what the closet is looking like it's basically going to stay with the same setup but i just want to declutter my shoes here as well as my heels i'm definitely going to be selling some of the heels here probably some of the bags because i just use the same three if i'm being honest i have here all of my winter clothes for the most part some more sweaters and winter stuff there I'm also going to be decluttering my perfume and probably selling some on Poshmark as well. I have some bridal things here that I am going to be getting rid of and then some coats in this little section. And then this right here is my summer spring clothing as well as the things that I have in the dresser. You're probably thinking, Natalie, this isn't as bad. Yeah. Yeah, I just do that. So let's Let's actually declutter and get rid of as much as I can. Outside my window Is everything pale and cold Alright, so here is everything I had on the floor. Nothing is dirty, I just didn't have a place to organize it. So I'm going to downsize this pile first and then move on to different sections in my closet like I usually do. Can't seem to pick up my phone it's been ringing all day long Behind these clothes I know the sun will be But today's raining So be patient with me I'll be right Somehow I must be Somewhere the sky is blue Alright, so I think I'm going to start here today and decluttering my spring and summer clothing because these are the items that I'm not going to be touching for the next couple of months. Um, there are some dresses here that honestly don't fit me. I just haven't worn in the last two years. So those are the ones that I'm going to be focusing on to fully declutter. As you guys know, I usually throw everything on top of my bed and then I declutter it um, and make a few different piles. One for keeping, one for donating, one for selling, and another one to throw away if it's in really bad shape. So today I'm going to be doing it straight off from here and using this clothing rack to put the items that I'm going to be selling or trying on and see if it actually fits me still because that's another story. To the good days, here's to the sorrows. If this is a mistake, I know about tomorrow. I don't wanna fight no more, cause I don't feel the need no more. No, just wanna make it stop. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe we just hit the end of the road. Right now, it doesn't even matter. It's too late. This area has been color coordinated and also decluttered. As you can see, I got rid of a lot and there's also a pile down there, but I have some more dresses that I need to fit here. There's actually a lot of space. Like if I 
do that, you know? We had so, a good run. Do Don't say we didn't. I was your first love, and you were my first one. Cheers to all the memories, the venom and the remedies, yeah. Promise I won't forget. declutter all of my whites basically mainly bridal dresses some that I've worn some that I feel like I'm not going to wear and some that just don't fit right so I'm going to declutter these and see which one I need So sweaters and white dresses as well as coats are decluttered. Now moving on to jeans up here, some pants, blazers, and some more coats. I have to admit the hardest things for me to get rid of are dresses and pants because once I find the perfect length, I automatically have an attachment to the item because it's really hard for me to find pants and dresses that fit me right. That being said, I have a few in here that I know don't fit me. So I'm going to try them on, just a couple, um, so that I can fully declutter and just like close that chapter. The lighting here sucks, but I recently saw a TikTok that truly resonated with me because again, I just have an attachment to pieces for whatever reason. It could be emotional memories, or like I mentioned, they just fit me right at a point in my life that I hope to get back to so that being said for the past few years now i've gained a little bit of weight and you know things just don't fit me as they used to and my train of thought was always like i'm going to lose it i'm going to get back to how i was because i just was that size for so so long in my life that now being let's say like a size six it's different than being a size zero so even though i want to lose about 10 pounds or so for the wedding and just for my own personal health i just personally feel better 10 pounds less i'm still going to be getting rid of the stuff that i just no longer fit because i feel like even when I get back to that weight, let's say, if I would ever get back to that weight, these pieces I no longer resonate with. I'm sure I can find other pieces to replace it. So that being said, let's start decluttering. All right, so these pants have been the ones that I've been saving for the last, like, I don't know, four years now in hopes for me to fit into them again. And, you know, reality is I'm not. So I'm going to try it one last time to say goodbye to them. Here they are. I, you know, like, I will never be. All right, these fit if I completely stop breathing. But, you know, who wants to be that uncomfortable, you know? Oh, my God. Another one that fits, but I just basically have to stop breathing, so. Also... I 
All right, just finished organizing the closet. Let's see how long it actually takes me keeping it this way, even though I did declutter a lot this time around. So hopefully everything stays where it belongs. But let's show you where I keep everything. Starting up here, I just have some boxes. This is my Chanel, YSL, Gucci shoes, which I'll be selling on Poshmark. These are gifts from our engagement party. And this has a bunch of like Cricut DIY stuff. I have my two hats in here shorts, regular jeans, and then this is technically blazers, pants, and some of my coats. Moving on to my perfume corner, which I am obsessed with. I decluttered and also organized by color. I've been saying that I'm going to make a perfume collection ever since I started my YouTube channel, and I still haven't. But now that it's fully decluttered and organized, I'm definitely going to do it. So I just have some whites up there, clear, colorful ones and then the gold and then above i have some hats i decluttered my bags and of course i'm facing my top three favorites um for boots i have it also color coordinated as much as i can then some sneakers my heels pumps sandals also by color and i actually have space for more shoes which I love that for me. Now, straight up, when you walk in, this is what you look at. So I have my sweaters here, also color-coordinated as much as I can, some jumpsuits. Then this right here is like my bridal white outfits, more coats, and then my summer dresses, tops, and stuff like that. And then I actually have three mom dressers from Ikea. So here I just keep my underwear, PJs, and some regular tops, bras, socks, and my workout clothes all the way in the bottom. Then I have my base bag, and in here I'm just going to tuck in some IKEA bags filled with my donation slash Poshmark items. But if they don't sell on Poshmark, I am donating everything. So yeah, check out my Poshmark because it's not going to last a long time. And then this dresser just has a bunch of random stuff, so some like sweatshirts hoodies, sweatpants, and then in this one I keep my bathing suits up here, some clutches, bags, which I actually like how this one turned out. I have belts, leather gloves, my clutches, my handmade not the label bags, and then all the way in the bottom I just have some sandals. And flat. But yeah, that's pretty much my closet tour slash decluttering for the fall time. If you guys haven't done so already, I highly recommend to do so. It truly feels like I can breathe in here, which makes me so happy. But I'm now going to be trying on everything that I'm going to be sending on Poshmark, taking pictures and listing them. So make sure to check out the link in the description. But thank you so much for watching. I'm so happy to be back on YouTube, hopefully uploading more consistent. So have a great day. Mm -hmm.